I never understood the concept of struggle love. Love is love, right? At least according to you swirlers out there. Jumbo, Jumbo, Salawam, Salam, family. Hope everybody is well. Do appreciate your viewership. For our start, always praises to the Most High. Now, <laughs> this this conversation keeps me engaged for a number of reasons. For one, I love watching my people use the very same insults and very same derogatory statements and comments as the oppressor, as the supremacist use. And it's, it's crazy. Because you would think with people that get stripped every day of their identity from the system that we live in and the system that we've been subject to conform to, you would think that my people would work together. Now, I've never heard of any of these terms before I came on YouTube, like Strag and um, blue pill, uh, red pill, MGTOW, shit like that. Never heard of it until I got on YouTube, aka Fool Tool. It, it's it's kind of like we shoot ourselves in the foot. I don't understand why we don't get it, but I think the world got it that a lot of us are jokes. And a lot of us are just something that you could watch for entertainment, get your laughs off, and get back to your system that caters to you. Because that's what we become, entertainment on here. And that's something that I refuse to indulge in. That's not something I want to participate. When I first heard of Struggle Love, I never, I never heard that outside of YouTube. So it's another word that I've never heard outside of YouTube. They, the swirlers, I should say they, they're the ones that are always saying love is love, right? So how can love be struggle? All relationships have challenges. Yes or no? Yes or no? So when you say something like, Loving your own people, loving your own women, loving your own men. That's a struggle. I never knew that loving yourself, having a certain amount of self-esteem in your soul, loving your people for what, what it's worth and what you see was struggle love. Going through the ups and downs with your tribe, the struggle of, do you realize we are the only group that have this type of mindset? And I, by all, by, by any means, am not advocating for the fuckery, whether it comes from the sister side or the brother side. We all got problems. We all have our issues and our own individual struggles. But why do we got to put ourselves down? There's nothing struggle about being there for your people and being there for your, the, your people's success, people's failures. I think one way we can combat a lot of these problems that we're having, because I can, uh, I think we all can agree we all want to live good and this and that. But we could start with communication. 
mature communication, mature dialogue, and having a discussion about a lot of our issues instead of lashing out at one another. Don't you think? I mean, hey, that's what I think. But let me know what you think in the comment section. Y'all be good. Much love. I love all y'all. Be safe. Shalom.